let's, sort of let's reply to that. Let's flip it around. How do they respond when people say, well, clearly Mohammed married a six-year-old and, and, and consummated the, mar the wedding when she was nine years old. That's clearly paedophilia, which everyone is against. Modern society as a whole is against, but the Christian faith is certainly against. How do they come back to that? Oh, well, they, they will try to justify it by saying that, um, you know, that, that, that they, the funniest one is they'll say things like, you know, women do develop faster in hot culture, in, in hot temperatures. Like that's that's almost oh it's almost ancient Greek forms of reasoning that heat controls your development. <laughs> so the, the the other one is that you know the the the, the more intellectualized you could you call it that defense is this idea that Aisha was physically and mentally mature right. um, to to become married. She's now, a grown up six year old. She was a grown up six year old to consent to marriage, which. A child cannot reason. consent. Exactly, a child can't consent. They haven't got the frontal lobe development. They don't have a long vision necessary to make long, long uh, view choices. Um, so she couldn't consent. But then their defence is, well, her father consented for her, That's which, which admits that she was immature. Right. If her father's making the decision for her, then there is an admission that the daughter is immature and can't make the decision for herself. Um, which then gets into the idea of forced marriage.